Welcome to A Kind and Gentle Word. I'm Jordan, and today is day 27 in our walk through the book of Psalms. And Psalm 27 is one of my favorite chapters in Psalm. It's a chapter that I return to time after time when life just won't stop, when the hits just keep coming, when the battle feels like all is lost. Psalm 27 is a picture of fearless trust in God, the type of trust that only God can provide. Psalm 27, verse 1. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the defense of my life. Whom shall I dread? When evildoers came upon me to devour my flesh, My adversaries and my enemies, they stumbled and fell. Though a host encamp against me, my heart will not fear. Though war rise against me, in spite of this, I shall be confident. One thing I have asked from the Lord that I shall seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of the Lord and to meditate in his temple. For in the day of trouble, he will conceal me in his tabernacle. In the secret place of his tent, he will hide me. He will lift me up on a rock. And now my head will be lifted up above my enemies around me. And I will offer in his tent sacrifices with shouts of joy. I will sing, yes, I will sing praises to the Lord. Hear, O Lord when I cry with my voice, and be gracious to me and answer me. When you said, seek my face, my heart said to you, your face, O Lord, I shall seek. Do not hide your face from me. Do not turn away your servant in anger. You have been my help. Do not abandon me nor forsake me, O God of my salvation. For my father and my mother have forsaken me, but the Lord will take me up. Teach me your way, O Lord, and lead me in a level path because of my foes. Do not deliver me over to the desire of my adversaries, for false witnesses have risen up against me, and such as breathe out violence. I would have despaired unless I had believed that I would see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Wait for the Lord, be strong, and let your heart take courage. Yes, wait for the Lord. Each time I read Psalm 27, I try to do so out loud, and I hear certain verses ring true in different times of my life. Quite a few of these verses are speaking to me today, but as always, verse 14 stands strong and true and shouts straight into my heart, wait for the Lord, be strong, and let your heart take courage. Yes, wait for the Lord. No matter what battles come upon you each day, the Lord is in control. And each time we ask him to lead us on a level path, he will do it. He wants to lead you step by step, every moment, every hour, every day. So when the Lord says, seek my face, our heart will say to him, your face, O Lord, I shall seek. Remember to be kind to others and gentle with yourself for we are all a work in progress.